everyone this is Deborah welcome to my channel it is a hot one we had a storm last night blew out the electricity a tree fell on the wires but today's video is about things that women do that really annoy men maybe not all men but first thing is being on your phone the whole time if you're on a date or if you haven't seen your significant other all day or whatever Get off your phone, put it somewhere, because that lets the person know that you're not important. Yeah, that is the most, I guess, annoying thing. And I actually had a, um, a, a fiance that got up in the middle of the night and followed me to the bathroom and looked at me through the louver doors because uh, he thought I was surfing the internet. Well, I was in a place so remote, I couldn't get on the internet. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, another annoying thing that men don't like about women is you wear too much makeup. If your eyebrows look like boxes, you got, you, you're doing it wrong, girls. Guys don't like that. Or if your eyelashes are so long that you could swap flies with them, you're doing it wrong. Men, most men like a very natural look. You can cover up your flaws without looking like a freaking clown. So if you are spending more than a minute drawing on your eyebrows, you're doing it wrong. Men don't like that. Uh, some of you all look like Groucho Marx and you look stupid. Stop it. And who in the hell has time to put on false eyelashes every day? Another thing that women do is talk about uh, spend too much time with their family uh, that can that can run a relationship um, you know because when you get married or whatever you're supposed to cling to your spouse not be you know always over at your mom and dad's house or your sisters that is annoying to men too also women that interrupt I'm kind of guilty of that I'm trying as long as you recognize the behavior uh, let the man talk and for God's sake, if you haven't complimented your husband or your boyfriend on giving you those fantastic back rubs or foot massages or actually going and learn, uh, earning a living, you're doing it wrong. Go and thank them for everything. Be complimentary and do this often. Don't forget to hug. And for you guys and girls who are just kissing each other with a little peck, no, how about really make out? Yeah, that will turn on uh, people like nothing else. Really kiss, not those little pecks. Who in the hell? Okay, another thing that women do is they bitch and complain. A woman should only have to say something once, or a man only has to say something once to get their point across. When a, when your significant other comes home from work, don't pounce on them. Don't say, oh, well, the kids did this, or my grandkids did this. Let them chill. Let them go use the bathroom. Uh, fix them a drink. Men hate that. They hate to have to listen to all the crap that he's getting from his boss and then comes home and he gets it from you. Now, there's such thing as constructive criticism. A lot of guys don't get that. If your guy is not doing half of the housework, that means the yard work included, uh, yeah, then there is calls to bitch. <laughs> but it will catch up with you. Sometimes it's better just to hire somebody if you've got the money to do what you think your spouse should be doing. But, um, yeah. Uh, and... This is, the, I think, the most horrific is women who spend money that needs to go in the bank in a relationship. A certain amount of your money should go in the bank for a rainy day. Uh, some women spend money like frickin' water. I hear this all the time from a lot of relatives and friends that their, uh, their woman in their life is uh, just spending money where it should be going to a future house or stuff like that. Uh, money is very valuable and uh, let's see what else um, I think that covers it all 
I think men get annoyed at women when they want their alone time, when they want to go hunting or fishing. You don't need to be with your spouse all the time. Girls, let the guys go be with their friends. Let them go do, uh, let them reconnect with their friends. And when they come home, they'll be happier, you know? And women who are controlling, men hate this. You don't control every aspect of their day. And if you have to change your partner, you don't you don't want that partner. Let me tell you what, if you think you're gonna get in a relationship and stop somebody from drinking or smoking or whatever, you're doing it wrong, people. Uh, you should be getting into a relationship with someone that you like them just the way they are. Bye, everyone.